interested. Hey everyone, if you'd like to try out Filmora and start creating amazing videos, check the link in my description. That's where you can download Filmora directly. Don't miss it. Welcome. First, drag a picture onto the timeline, then go to Effects and apply the square blur as demonstrated. I went to Media, dragged in another picture, right-click to crop it to fit, then click the crop icon above to fine-tune the frame and applied the changes. Next, go to Effects, search for and apply the border effect. Then click it and adjust the border size to 5 and blur to 1. Afterward, go up to the basic settings and scale it down to 40 as shown. You can either drag the picture upward manually or set the position X to minus 488 and position Y to 211. Then scroll down, set rotate to minus 12, and continue scrolling to apply drop shadow to place the picture in the top left corner as shown. Now duplicate the picture by holding Alt while dragging it upward. Select the duplicate, then go up to remove the minus sign from 488 in position X and from 12 in rotate to move the picture to the top right corner. Next, go to Media, drag in another picture while holding Alt to replace the one on the timeline as show. Once more, hold Alt and drag the picture upward to duplicate it. Select the duplicate and set position X to minus 36 and position Y to minus 264 to move it downward. Scroll down to rotate and reset it to zero. Then go to media, drag in another picture while holding alt to replace it. Click the crop icon to fine tune the framing and apply the changes as shown. Now take a PNG snapshot, then select all the pictures on the timeline and delete them. Next, go to media, drag the snapshot onto the timeline and extend its duration to 10 seconds as shown. Click the crop icon, choose pan and zoom above and adjust the start and end frames as shown. When you're satisfied with the positioning, click apply. Next, move the playhead to the middle at 5 seconds and split the clip. With the second segment selected, click the crop icon, adjust the start frame toward the third picture, then click the swap icon to switch the start and end frames, and click apply as shown. Finally, go to Effects and search for Flicker Bevel Cut. Drag it onto the timeline and extend it to match the full duration. Then return to Effects, search for Vignette Radius, drag it down, and extend it to the same length. Preview your project. Thanks for watching. The template link and the Filmora download link are in the description. Have a beautiful day.